And our action comes to you from the Potteries. Hello from the Stoke City Stadium. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Stoke City facing Everton. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And here's the team for Everton. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. James Tarkovsky plays with Michael Keane in central defence. Abdoulaye Ducouré plays alongside Idrissa Gay in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Dominic Calvert-Lewin. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Lewis Baker, Pearson, can they trouble the opposition this time? Excellent defending. McNeil. And now with Young. And space here on the flank. Calvert Lewin takes the shot. In it goes, the opening goal in this contest. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. So underway again here, one nil the score. And space to cross it. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. No nonsense clearance. Calvert Lewin. He will be. Ducouré. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Well, the half-time interval coming up. It's Everton on top. Stuart, your overall take. Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Not testing the keeper at all with that effort. McNeil. Oh, that's a super ball over the top. Can he convert? Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. And over comes the corner. McNeil. Must score. And a goal! They've increased their lead, and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. is moving again 2-0 is how it stands there will be one minute added on at the end Calvert-Lewin and there we have it the referee's whistle and that will do it for the first half here on the Potteries and I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Yeah, he's not had his usual impact, has he? He just hasn't got on the ball in dangerous positions. He's got to keep working hard to find that little bit of space to make something happen, that's for sure. Well, 
Well, the second half underway, and that was a huge statement by Everton in the first 45. Are we in for more of the same here? Ducouré. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Ducouré. Well, the stats don't lie. Everton have had a lot of possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. Oh, just mistimed his run, and the flag going up. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Pearson. Can they create something from here? And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Idrissa Gay. It will be now. McNeil. Decided to come in from the flank. And no way through. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Oh, showing excellent vision. He's got to score! And there it is! Still life left in this game, and they have the momentum now. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Well, underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. It will be. It's with Ducouré. It will be now. This looks promising from Everton. But really sticking to the task defensively. Jacob Brown. Ducouré. Determined defending. Slipshod passing. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. All in all, a broken counter-attack. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. Ducouré. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, I think the fans are doing everything they can to get their team back into this. But can they find that moment of inspiration and get an equaliser? Simple save, really. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. And I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?